The day after a 15-year-old boy drowned in Seven's Pond, the rope swing where he was playing hung from the tree, marking the area where he disappeared. Around 7 o'clock Sunday night, a 911 caller reported the boy had gone underwater. On arrival, we had some civilian boats that were on scene searching uh, for the victim, uh, as well as a couple police officers in the water searching as well. Bedford Fire Department deployed two boats and began a grid search. Witnesses telling officials the teen had surfaced briefly before slipping under the water. We did have an idea from bystanders on the scene um, where the individual entered the water. Even with that lead, firefighters say the searching conditions were less than ideal. Sebens Pond is a uh, stagnant water. Uh, there's no real flow, but there, so the conditions of the water are pretty murky. Visibility is not very good. A dive team from the Nashua Fire Department was called in to assist, along with New Hampshire Marine Patrol and New Hampshire Fish and Game. Some two hours after the initial call, the divers located the victim. Water in the, in the area where we found the victim was approximately 15 feet. The drowning remains under investigation, but Bedford police say at this point it appears accidental. Reporting live in Bedford, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.